Drum roll, please. Drum roll. <laughs> I'm just a Barbie. Barbie lover and was tired. Thanks for watching my video. Today I'm showing you my top five favorite Barbie purse. Yeah. I have shown you in the live streaming before, but today I'm making a video because some people uh, requested me about my purses. Yeah, you wanna see my purses? Quick. I put my Barbie purse there, my handbags. But of course, those are not. All of them. Yeah, I have some more in closet, you know. <laughs> but today I'm thinking to pick up my top five favorite, and I want to show you one by one. So let me pick. Let's count down from number five. Number five is that bling bling. So this this is my DIY misguided Barbie clutch purse. The base original one is from Misguided from a couple years ago. Yeah, it used to be like clear. Yeah, it was like totally see-through clear. It only had a pink Barbie logo on the surface. But I put this crystal. Yeah, I decorated it. And on the back side, I even covered back side. And the back side is pink ombre. And they're pretty. I mean, gorgeous, right? It's beautiful. Yeah, I cannot believe I did one by one. I mean, <laughs> I have some patience, obviously, but I, I think it's totally worth it. It turned out really good. Yeah, I know some people have been asking me, you know, if I could sell this, but if I had to sell this, it won't be any cheaper than 700 because I spend a lot of money and time on this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So yeah, and it's this really cool one. It has gold chain strap, so you can use as just clutch bag or crossbody. Yeah, this is perfect for fancy like red carpet ish party. Yeah, I always bring this to Barbie convention. Actually, I never wear the same dresses at com Barbie convention, but for purse, I don't mind because I love this one and this one. Looks really small, but it still holds little size wallet, my cell phone, and lipstick. And it's enough. Oh yeah, plus car key. Yeah, so it's perfect for party. So it's my number five. And number four. Ta -da! The vintage look Barbie purse from Play No More. I love this girl. I love. So it's from the Apple brand Play No More from South Korea. And yeah, it was from like three years ago maybe. And this is a really well made purse. And here it has the eye logo. And it's like forked crocodile skin looks. And then on the front it has Barbie print. But the headband part is like it has different fabric here, different material. Looks like like kind of like a Velcro-ish, you know? It, it has a little funny texture. I love her look a lot. It's just so, so pretty, really pretty. She looks like a vintage, but also like American comic book look. You know, you know what I'm saying? She's so cute. It also came with strap so uh you could use as a crossbody as well but when i carry this usually i just carry with the handle yeah the inside oh yeah see that strap um it looks a little but it's pretty big it's big enough to carry whatever you need you know you can carry cell phone wallet little makeup stuff yeah it holds stuff well i really love when the purse is cute and functional together and next number three hard to pick what's hard to pick mm. Ta -da! barbie number one doll purse los angeles can sold separately i love this purse a lot i got this purse from barbie harajuku like several years ago and yeah it has really cute gold chain strap it's super cute it's like it's gold chain with 
pink satin ribbon really pretty yeah the material is fox leather only the barbie part is embroidered you see and the other part is printed in the inside it's all pink as well and it also has one pocket yeah so again this purse is also functional really useful and pretty big enough it can hold big size wallet cell phone some makeup stuff yeah and even when i go a little shopping and like some little accessories i can put it here you know it's perfect this one it's really useful because i can style with some both for casual look and little formal look you know like a little bit dressy but still goes well and it's perfect pink. I love this. And it's unique. I mean, it has a sense of humor. Yeah, I love this. It's from Barbie Harajuku and so not much people have this. So pretty rare. So it's my number three. And number two. Barbie Clutch from Charlotte Olympia. Yay. Actually, this is the most expensive Barbie purse I have. It was like $1,400. I know the price. I always say the price is not pretty, but the purse is really pretty. So, okay. The whole look is like this. This is just beautiful purse. And even before Charlotte Olympia collaborated with Barbie, they were one of my favorite shoe brand like high-end shoe brand i love charlotte olympia shoes and purses a lot they make beautiful clutches and shoes not just beautiful but always so unique they always blow my mind so it has beautiful barbie buckle and when you open like this i know it's like fancy chocolate box or something when you open it it has gold mirror yeah gold mirror rare huh and this side is also gold and said and it has logo charlotte olympia made in italy look at this detail you know the edge looks so cute and this clutch i have seven plus doesn't fit <laughs> i know but you know what it's okay. I will just hold it with my hand. So when I carry this purse, I literally put a couple of my cards, credit cards, and my ID, driver's license, you know, and my lipstick. That's it. You don't need a mirror because it has a mirror here, which I love. The car key will fit, but I have to remove my keychain for sure. <laughs> my gosh, yeah. So this is my number two Barbie purse. And... Finally, I will show you my number one favorite purse. Drum roll, please. <laughs> anyway, you do it. Okay, number one is. Ta da! Moschino Barbie Collection Envelope Clutch Bag This is my favorite favorite purse Why? No, you know why It's pretty, it's pretty enough It deserves to be number one So it's Moschino Barbie Collection and It doesn't say Barbie But uh, they are officially collaborated And yeah, so it's officially Barbie Collection So it's clutch purse And then the shape is like envelope so you can hold as a clutch or also you can use as a crossbody and that's big enough i can put my stuff like pretty much everything i need yeah and it's just so cute and also the material is pretty strong even when it get wet or dirty or like you know i can wipe off so that's also why i love this is my number one favorite but i also got another type i also have this more casual one the same material, same print, but like a bigger size crossbody one. So when I need to carry more stuff, even more stuff, or when I wear like hoodie dress with Doc Martin boots, and maybe I will carry this, you know. I like both, but this is my number one. 
I will keep this purse forever. Which one was your favorite? Tell me which one was your favorite. Leave and tell me which one was your favorite on my comment section. I hope you enjoyed watching a part of my collection today. I will do this top 5 video sometimes again. Like my top 5 Barbie shoes, my top 5 favorite pink box, or whatever, something like that. Yeah. Thanks for watching my video. Stay home, be safe, be happy. Hope you have pink stastic Barbie quarantine. Bye.